This is Coach Lydia Knight. We are ending eating disorders and freeing women from every cage. And freedom is being naked. So when you have a struggle with food and when you hate your body, you avoid seeing your own body. You don't wanna see yourself in the mirror. You might even cover up mirrors. We had a client who just covered all the mirrors in her house. It would take showers in the dark. She just like could not see her own body. It was just so painful to see her own image because there were so many emotions of shame and guilt and anger and failure and all of that, especially when we see our bodies as this project that we're either you know passing or failing. And so, we avoid seeing our own bodies. Like we wear clothing that covers us up. So in a way where we don't see our shape, we wear dark colors, we wear flowy things. Um, we're in this place where we, we sort of forget about and ignore our own bodies because we hate them. And on the side of freedom, there is a neutrality around our bodies. And then as we keep going on our journey, there's a like of our bodies and there's a love of our bodies. There's an appreciation of our bodies. There's a celebration of our bodies. And it's cool to be naked. Like we had a client the other day who she's like, yeah, I just got naked. And I stood in front of the mirror and I'm like, this is fine. She's like, this is great. She's like, I didn't feel any of those negative emotions that I used to feel. Like I can see myself naked now. And it is such a beautiful marker of freedom to be naked, to be fine with being naked, to be fine with other people seeing you naked. That's a fun thing that we get to celebrate in our community, not seeing each other naked. Anyway, but anyway, <laughs> what I mean is our clients celebrating that like, hey, my partner, I used to hide my body from them. And now I am like, enthusiastically cool with them seeing me naked because I'm, I'm good with my body. So it's a beautiful thing. And you, for your next step to freedom, go to lifewithlydia.com.